Electric coupling module. You said it was nothing serious when I came in. You said you were sure. Guess I was wrong. You can always look for another shop where they won't ask a lone nomad while she's hugging the border. I'm gonna pay you what we agreed. Not one anymore. Huh. For that, you can borrow my tools and fix it yourself. That's fine. Step aside. What? Got any idea what to do? Mm. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Mm. And? And your chirping is not helping. I'm gonna bypass the coupling and rig a hot wire. Compress will run on and on. Could seize up. Did anyone ask your opinion? Okay, let's see what happens. It's like I was telling you. No. Not shabby at all. Questions how long it'll last you. It'll get me to Night City. I'll figure something else out there. Right. You know, I don't have all day. I'm looking for someone. Jackie Wells? Maybe, maybe. So doable? Sure was. Satisfy seeing that. Not a solid fix. Might as well have used spit and duct tape. It worked. That's what matters. Mm. Antenna on this heap don't seem like it packs a punch. Not liable to him much. You don't say. Hey, Mike. Didn't know you had a customer. Uh, rolled in a, a few hours past. I I thought she'd at least called in to you. Don't you swear to Mike. We're gonna hash it out. Don't you know you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. No need to worry. I won't be staying long. Didn't answer my question now, did you? Name's Andrew Jones. Probably heard of me. I can't say that I have. Served in spec ops during the last war. Silver show guns? Ring any bells? I can't say that it does. Don't like to get along, do you? That a nomad vehicle? Might have expected that. I'll just fix it up and go. I have no reason to linger. <sighs> no, nope, you sure shit don't. Nothing boils my blood like a fucking strain. Where'd your clan pitch camp? Are you one of those who believe everything the talking heads say? The nomads are the world's greatest evil? No. I'm a man that respects order. Corpse brought us that order, and I intend for it to stay that way. The corpse pay you and have you on a leash like a dog, you know that? Mm-hmm. But you don't want to see me bear my fangs. So I'll ask again. Where's your clan? There's no clan. There's no camp. I'm here alone. Ain't buying it. Nomads always stick to their packs. My family's in pieces. That's why I'm headed for Night City. Makes you an outcast among outcasts. Sure as hell hope you'll be on your way before long. I heard this place was famous for its hospitality. Ah, oh, glad to see it wasn't just rumors. You're damn right we are. 
when people come along who know how to behave. I saw a broadcasting comms tower on my way in. My antenna's down and I need to radio someone. What you need's to hightail it out of here without another word. Ain't got no mind to see you drifting around these parts. Got it? You like the sound of your voice, don't you? What's that, Drifter? What are you on about? Nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> yeah. Best that way. Finally. Willie McCoy, it's good to hear your voice. Fee, wish I could say the same. Why can't you? You abandoned the clan. I can't help you anymore. Never knew you to be so cautious. Try loyal. Rules are rules. The system won't work without them. It can't. Nomads get the work in these parts because it's nomad turf. Wouldn't be a problem if you're still a backer. You should have stuck with them and joined up with the Snake Nation like the rest. The Snake Nation can kiss my ass. I need your help. One last time. One last time. Again? I have to find the client with my payload, but I, I don't know where he is. Hmm. Right place, right time. You were there? Of course I was. Maybe the client left a message. Could you check for me? Hmm. Sure. Last time, though. I mean it. Client's name? Jackie Wells. Huh. Actually left a message. He's waiting on a farm. Clicking you the geolog data. Thanks, Willie. I owe you one. You do. Just don't get yourself killed. And don't call again. Worried I'd have to turn to farming. <laughs> yeah, sure hope you're here for me. I believe I am. Are you. Name's Jackie Wells. V. Seems you have cargo that needs to be moved. 
Oh, where I'm from, you share a bit about your soul before you talk biz, eh? It's kind of like a custom. Or just good manners, you know? Why don't we start with you, then? NC native, right here. Got Haywood in my blood. I've never been to NC. That doesn't mean much to me. So, imagine a place where everyone's like your bro or sis. Or a distant cousin, at least. <sighs> I think I understand. You don't have to like each other, but it's family. That's Haywood. That and everyone's back in iron. And you? I guess you could say I'm from my own Haywood. You and me, we're gonna get along fine. The cargo. Let's load it in the car. Oh, we will. I started thinking you might not come. I got held up. And you weren't exactly easy to find. I decided to lay low, you know? The sheriff, he looked like one grouchy motherfucker. Yep. Ugh. What a fat ass. Oh, we headed out? Do you have the manifest from the transport? Of course I do. But the fixer didn't give you the job deeds? He... he did. I was just making sure. Listen, friend. We're both professionals, ain't we? Why? Are you nervous? Me? <laughs> well, uh, maybe a little. Hey, water crossing up ahead. What now? Nothing. They'll scan us and check our papers. <sighs> okay. I'll do the talking. Security check will begin shortly. I got a real bad feeling about this. Hand me the manifest. They'll need to see it. Grab these. Let me see. Ah, it's marked LOA. Perfect. What's that mean? Lost on arrival. Means the cargo was flagged as to be lost as soon as it crossed the border. Oh, so they know we're smuggling. Well, they're about to find out. The owner of the vehicle in the inspection area will report for further questioning. <sighs> Chingana madre. What now? If we want the customs officer to turn a blind eye to our dubious docks, we'll need a sweetener. Do you have the credit chip with the bribe? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Forgot about that. Right. You forgot. I'll keep the engine running, in case of a cock-up. Do that. If you're armed, place your weapon here. Now please report to room number two. Room two. Please sit. Papers. Is this routine? It might be. We'll see. Hmm. 
What are you transporting? It's all in there. Everything? There's one additional enclosure to the manifest. Ah, yes. Remind me, you drive for which nomad clan? I don't think that's any concern of yours. Is that what you believe? You know, whenever I see someone like you, I'm oh so grateful not to be on that side of the table. The feeling's mutual. Go on now. Your associate's waiting for you in the car. Don't forget to take your personal items. Be careful with that toy. And welcome to Night City. Those little shits imagine Night City is some kind of paradise. What can you do? Young, naive, which is just a euphemism for ignorance. What happened in there? I'll tell you soon. You need to get out of here. Yeah, okay. You gonna tell me what happened back there? A customs dickhead got nitpicky. And that ain't normal? Not to that extent. Smelling trouble around the bend? Drive, Jackie, just drive. Someone's coming our way. This does not look good. Stop your vehicle immediately. Let's get out of here. On it. You are transporting contraband that is corporate property. I repeat, stop the car. Damn. Sometimes these things happen. This? What kind of shit happens? Border security tipped off the corporation that we have their cargo. What's the deal with these borderlies flipping us the finger as they fucking please? With no consequences. He took a risk. He assumed we didn't have a clan backing us, and he was right. <sighs> so what now? 
We've crossed the border. Now you pay me, and we go our separate ways. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. I'm a bit light. I can't pay you now. I have something for you once I collect my scrap for this corpo crap we're carrying. Oh, and you just figured I would sit by patiently? Actually, I wasn't gonna pay you at all. It's just gonna bust ass and disappear as soon as we crossed over, but... You're all right. You tricked me. Oh, well, apologies for offending the spotless moral code of a smuggler. So what's next? Now we take a peek inside. Open it. Oh, shit. Says Arasaka on the crate. We are robbing some heavy hitters. And maybe we'll make some heavy money. Oh, mamis. A real iguana. A, uh, lesser Antillian, I think. Think you can make some money on it? Sure. Think it'll make us happy. Us? Yeah, partner. We'll go half seas. Any decent fixer will find a loaded gonk interested in a rare gem like this. It's kind of a shame, though. I always wanted a pet. Got the name Manny all thought out. Hey, by the way, you, uh, got any plans for what you'll be doing in Night City? Why do you ask? Because I got this feeling you got a lot of time and nothing to spend it on. And then see... Ain't a city that lets you get by without buddies. But don't you worry. Let me help you find digs. You gotta live somewhere. It's important to have people you can turn to. You know, like, uh, family. Maybe you'll find your own down in Night City. Thanks, much appreciated. Hey, come on. It's nothing. They got chemistry, you and me. Be a crying shame to waste it. Partner. Hey! Oh. Cuddly little fucker. Okay, partner. Time to grab the lizard and scurry out of here. <laughs>